And we start to tell with that breaking news of yet another deadly night in the district. A carjacking turned deadly. It is one of two separate shootings that we're following closely. Fox 5's Shamari Stone joining us live from Northeast with the breaking updates tonight. Shamari? Hey guys, well we've confirmed from our D.C. police sources that this shooting that happened here in Northeast in the Noma neighborhood was a random carjacking that ended in murder. Right now you can see we're here at N Street Northeast and 3rd Street Northeast. And if you move a little to the right over there, many people who live in these nearby high-end apartment buildings in the Noma neighborhood are shaken up tonight. That's what they told me. Now, many of them were out on their balconies. They were looking through their windows looking right down here at this intersection because this is where, near where this carjacking happens. You can see these evidence markers here, these circles. The body was down here. This is where police tried CPR, trying to revive this man. Let's roll some video right now. And just to let you know, police are currently searching for that stolen gray Chrysler 200. Cell phone video taken just minutes after the carjacking shows police appearing to do CPR on the driver who was shot. People tell me this all started when a man walked up to the driver of the gray Chrysler 200, the year 2016. That is the year of the car. Well, witnesses say the two started arguing. They heard a lot of screaming and yelling, and then the carjacker fired at least two shots, hitting the driver around 7.20 tonight. That driver died. Police say the suspect then drove away in the victim's 2016 gray Chrysler 200 with D.C. tags GR3248. You're now going to hear exclusively from one of the witnesses. How are you feeling right now? I mean, this happened right outside of your apartment building. Just kind of freaky more than anything. I uh, always hear things like around, but never like directly outside. Tell us what happened, what you saw. Yeah, I was looking out my window and I kind of just heard yelling, which isn't that out of the ordinary. And then I heard like two or three shots and looked out and there was a guy like laying on the sidewalk and a woman next to him like screaming for help and a car was like pulled over there and then like drove away. And what was your reaction when you saw that? Just like freaked out. Um, again, like it's scary when it happens right in front of your place. I mean, these are hardworking folks, many of them working here in D.C. only to come outside and see this. It's very uh, disheartening. Now, let's tell you about that separate second shooting. This is a picture of the suspect. D.C. police saying he shot a man on the sidewalk on the 900 block of New York Avenue Northwest around 545 this evening. Medics drove the victim to a hospital. He was unconscious, but he was breathing. Homicide detectives are investigating. Police have not released a motive or what led up to that shooting. Back out here live, police have not released the updated condition of the man who was shot in Northwest. But again, we're here now in Northeast, and this was where the carjacking happened. If you have any information on these two separate shootings, call the Metropolitan Police Department. But I do want to tell you real quick that police are recommending that if you have your car, make sure that you put an air tag inside of it. That can help with these investigations, can help police catch the car and find the suspect.